Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for June 28th, 2020. Let's see what we have going on for today. All right. The card we have for today is gray. Learn to scan your body. The number is 29. That reduces to 11. Remember, 11 is a master number, so it doesn't go any further than that. Um, so yeah, we can take this quite literally. But the first thing I felt when this, when I just saw this, uh, was that we're kind of going into a gray area where we're not being so black and white about things. And this is even kind of going, I almost want to say like going gray. Like maybe you're just kind of like, I'm just going to disconnect for a moment, not because I don't care or that I'm not coming back pretty soon, but I just need to collect my thoughts. I need to get back in touch with my heart. I need to figure out and plug into what I actually am feeling so that I'm not getting pu so pulled around by other people's opinions and um, what they say I should believe or how I should uh, behave or whatever, right? So learn to scan your body. What is your body telling you? If you have uh, pains in certain areas of your body, that's a message. For example, when I, I've been trying to learn piano. So it's something I've wanted to do for a very long time. But every time I sit down at the piano, my joints kind of get stiff. Uh, there's a knot in my stomach. And if I sit with it and go, what is this? Well, this is hard. Okay, well, why does that bother you? Because music used to not be hard for me. When I was a little child, I mean, I was in elementary school, I picked up the violin and within a few months was playing at a high school level from memory. And, you know, I decided, oh, I got bored with the violin. Let me, I played saxophone. I picked up the saxophone, picked that up pretty quickly. Music used to come almost naturally to me. And here I am, like, and it's not the same. And what happened to my brain? And is it going to get worse? Like, <laughs> so there's part like missing, you know, how easily I used to be able to pick it up, but also feeling old. And then, you know, so if you listen to your body, doesn't mean that you need to give up, but there's a message there for you. And once I acknowledge that, you know, I'm curious to see if, you know, I just acknowledge that. So <laughs> when I go back to the piano, let's see if I feel a little more at ease. Sometimes just working through that process can help open the pathway for you, right? To get going in the direction that you want to go in. So listen to your bodies. Again, give yourself that chance to kind of consider all opinions, okay? Consider all sides of things and really tune into how you feel, all right? So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.